Oh, what a good old morning. Oh. Is that what time of year it is? Hmm. I need to get ready for Easter. I need a different outfit. I need to get prepared for Easter. Okay. Let's go shopping, and I might also have to go pick up some chocolate eggs. Oh, I'm excited to see the Easter Bunny! Okay, I'm here in town, and oh, this place looks under construction. Looks pretty cool. And I think this is it. This is the clothing store. Um, hello? Is anyone in there? Oh, hi. Yeah, I'd like to get a bunny-themed costume for Easter. Do you have any in stock? Uh, I don't think that this is what I was after when I meant bunny outfit for Easter. Uh, I need to go talk to them. Uh, do you have any other options? Okay, this feels a little bit more snug. It may have taken all day, but at least we found one that's pretty comfortable. I got a hoodie on. It's even got a cool little face at the back. I've got myself an Easter egg on the front. And on top, it even has little bunny ears. That's so cool. Oh, and then my favorite thing of all, look at my slippers. My blue little bunnies. That was a good purchase, but I think we're going to go back home now. What a nice little shop. I really enjoyed that. Well, maybe next time I might not wear such a tight outfit. Oh, it was going places where things really shouldn't be that tight. Hello and welcome back to Craft Daddy with me, Pintaro. <laughs> How cool is my Easter outfit? My sweet little bunnies. Oh, I love it. I love it. And the little bunny ears at the back. It's great. So I've had an idea for Easter this time around. And my idea is these chests right behind me, I've filled them full of some... I'll just show you. I filled them full of some treasures. Hello. The server's been really laggy lately. Hmm. I hope it's not my fault. Whoa. I did not know I could do that. That is so cool. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, so in these chests, I've set up a little goodie basket. So I've got the goodie block. I've got some diamonds, some lapis, a book and quill, which I've written in. I'll show you what's in it. I should probably explain what these are. So I'm planning an Easter egg hunt. So I'm going to be putting some eggs around all the three worlds, and then people have to then find where all the eggs are. So I've only got, I've got these four here. So these four here. And I've also completed two. So, missing Easter one, missing eggs two. I should probably change that to missing Easter. But then in this book, once they've found it, congratulations, you've collected all the Easter bunny drop eggs. For your help, you have been rewarded to the contents of this chest. Thank you for playing, and happy Easter. Wow, I suck at reading. <laughs> Bit, so I just gotta sign this book. I just realized, I don't think I signed the other books. Oh, well, that's fine, I'm not gonna sign this book. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to be putting these around the three worlds of Craftadia, and then there's going to be six, that's about six, yeah? There's going to be six eggs hidden throughout the, actually there's five. There's going to be five eggs hidden throughout the world, and then they're all going to have coordinates to the next egg. Yeah. And then the last one, which is the sixth one, they'll end up finding a chest full of all these goodies. So in saying this, I'm going to go give this... Actually, I'm going to change this one's name. But I'm going to go give this to a very special pug. And that pug is in my town. I can actually teleport to him. Oh. Well. I don't think I was meant to fall in here. Oh, is pug AFK? Ooh, he's been busy. Oh, hey. The gift. It's an egg hunt. <laughs> I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. I'll come down too. Whee. I don't have my boots on. That's a pretty cool idea, having bells along the outside. And then with the jump, I think my sounds are down. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, look, there's his old head. <laughs> oh, good times. So from Pug's base as well, Pug lives, I live that way, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, so he lives pretty close to me. I was going to fly there, but I realized I don't have any rockets. Oopsie. So now that Pug has his Easter egg hunt, I need to make four more, and then I can give away the five of them. So with this one as well, I want to give this one to the one, the only, 
Coffee Queen. So I'm going to save that one for her. And then I'm going to give these four ones to whoever is at spawn and wants to go on an egg hunt. That's the plan. Oh, and I also forgot. From last episode, I said that I was going to build... Oh, I said that I was going to build my little auto smelter thingy. And then right here, I finished it. It's a little nook in the wall. It's pretty cool. So I have two little systems here. So this is where you put your fuel. So whenever you have it, you just dump it in. And then when it's full or whenever it's ready to go, just hit the button. And then when lag doesn't hit in, it'll go off. <laughs> and then once there's nothing left in it, it'll come back. So let's say... Do I have anything here I can cook? Let's just grab some gold. Alrighty, things to be cooked. Pretty plain and simple. Open the crate, chuck it in, and then hit the button. And off it goes. Oops. So I'm talking to Pug and I may have given him the wrong coordinates. Sorry. I mean, this is a pretty cool mountain. I've never seen that before. Oops, I'm sorry, Pug. But back to this. <laughs> so after all the material that you put in there is cooked, I'll show you what's all behind it in a second. There's a little water flow and some droppers that drop it into the water flow, up, over, and then just behind these are some chests and hoppers. So like, if I do a big smelt and I need a lot of hoppers filled, I mean, chest filled, you know what I mean. It's back up. So then all the golden stuff I just cooked up, awesome. It's done. And a bit of glass too. So in showing you behind the doors, look at this mess. <laughs> it took a bit to figure out this main bit. So I need to put the redstone in to prevent these turnoffs from constantly just letting it go back down. But yeah, so this rail follows all the way up, it hits this, gets its turn, and continues on. So these are all hoppers into furnaces. Goes across, swings around, comes back. Coming on back, it'll run over that pressured rail. And then when it runs over there, if anything is in it, it'll send a signal to the comparator running down into this little repeater, into this signal. But then if there is something in there, I'm pretty sure if there is something in there, that'll turn on, goes across, into this redstone torch. And yeah. So... This little repeater bit here, if there is something in there, this will prevent this will prevent this one from turning off this light, which then prevents this from flicking over to these rails and going down to where it belongs. Just giving a little, uh, you know, let's break this. Give a little exercise run. So I hit the button, it'll go up, goes all the way across, hits that, the redstone goes off, and you saw that click, and it goes back down. But let's say if I put stone in there, I flick the button, it goes up, goes across all the hoppers, comes on down, and then see that didn't change? It goes all the way back around until it is empty, which might take a little bit of time, but that's fine. Yep. And just then you might have seen that in the corner of the eye, and then it goes back down. And it's kind of the same... Oh, yeah. I was like, why is this flickering? And it's the same concept for down here. It'll go across, go across, and then this rail right here is the one that flicks between that one and this one. With the exact same redstone right there that runs around into a redstone torch into this. And same thing with up here, except these are going to the side, which designates it as this is the fuel section. Then they all come across into these droppers here, and there's another set of this on the other side over there. Right over there. And it's just your general dropper clock thing runs into an ice rail down there up this little pathway here i should probably put this back there we go and then my stone is now done super smelter <sighs> okay let's get to making these this is probably take a while so just five hours later and the chest if and when it opens six done Technically six, I gave one to Pug. But now, it's time to give these out. So I wonder who would be happy to have an egg hunt? Hmm, let's go drop some off at spawn. <laughs>
Or maybe you just even ask chat, see if they want to have one. Maybe I'll even put one on the auction house. Hmm, I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna put one on the auction house. So let's sell one for, I don't know. Let's go a thousand. That should be right. I'd say that's pretty cheap because the totems and stuff go for about 2,000, so there is a totem, well, there is a totem in them, so yeah, I'd say it's pretty cheap. Okay, so I have three to give away. I'm keeping this one for Coffee Queen. The reason why I'm also saving one for Coffee Queen, she gave me the idea of dressing up for Easter because she got her Easter outfit and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna make my own. Okay, three to give away, let's head to spawn. Okay, here at spawn. Who wants to do my Easter egg hunt? <laughs> okay, so we got a couple contestants. Okay. Sailor, stop moving. <laughs> okay, so trade, let's get custard. Trade. Saber. Alrighty. Have fun. <laughs> I got one last book. Does anyone want it? Um. Cool. Give the trade, chuck it in. Ready up. Oh. The game's loading. Today would be not. <laughs> Got a golden carrot. <laughs> Have fun. About six hours of my time. And it's gone within less than five minutes. <laughs> Sweet. Well, I really hope they enjoy the egg hunt. Searching for all the eggs around um, Craft Area is going to be very interesting. Plus, I left a couple. Oh, hello. PvP Jackpot. Oh, I don't need those. <laughs> I forgot what I was talking about, I may have got distracted. Oh yeah, now I remember what I was going to say. I was going to say I left all the chests and stuff in very unique places, like very interesting landmarks and hilltops and all that. Yeah, I really hope they enjoy it. I got my Easter Bunny eggs. Let's go give it to some AFK people. Hey Pokey, you're going to get an egg. I hope you like it. Oh, it's even in inventory. How do I get you an egg? Can I just like... Whoa! Oh, I want to get you an egg. Let's just equip the wings. I have no rockets, do I? No, okay. I'm coming for you. I got this. Slow down. <sighs> what if I was just to land here? I reckon I can make this jump. Let's just land back here. Let's see if I can throw an egg from here. Stand right on the edge, look. Jump and throw! Oh, so close, okay. I'm gonna try that again. Yes, got it! <laughs> Happy Easter! Well, looking at chat, it looks like everyone's having fun with the eggs that they've done. I'm pretty happy with this. Do I follow the eggs, new cords? Yes! Oh, lag. There we go, that took a while. Chase. And then Saber here, he got his chest. Ah, amazing. And he enjoyed it. Even better. <laughs> Thanks for playing. Well, hello there. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, from the last episode, I mentioned that I got a new puppy. I'm going to put him up on screen. And I'm going to show you how cute he is laying in my back garden. In my backyard. Look at him laying there on the grass. Just living his best life. He's got his little elephant behind him. What a cutie. So he's an Aussie Shepherd cross Husky, which is an awesome breed. And all he wants to do is chew my fingers. But no. <laughs> That's why he's got his elephant, so I can get him to chew the elephant. But he's just so freaking cute. Oh, isn't he the cutest? He's got like the sad little puppy eyes, but he's so loved. He's out there eating sticks and leaves. I think he just likes the crunch of them. And then he gets even more sadder when I pull the sticks and leaves away from him. <sighs> I just love him so much! So I'm here at the event crates, and I got a little audience here. <laughs> hey everyone! So with these Easter keys, that is a massive car. <laughs> Let's see what we get from the first Easter key. Ooh. Oh, I want the bunny ears, that would be nice. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. I got the bunny ears! I got the bunny ears! Oh, it's a chocolate bunny. Definitely putting that on. Alright, second one. Let's see what we get. I 
Nine. Three mega keys. Ooh. Not bad. Not bad. Third key. Aww. Oh, the shulker box isn't too bad. <laughs> oh, I got a shovel! Woo! I get a carrot top. Oh, Easter leggings isn't too bad. I'm looking fancy. It froze. Oh, three more mega keys. <laughs> oh, that's kind of upsetting. Oh, we got the sword! Yo! Oh, it froze again. Oh, more leggings. Hello? Okay. Oh, spawn orange. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. He's so cute! <laughs> Here's a chicken nugget! Oh, tool, tool. We got another tool! Last one. Chicken nugget, we're gonna do good? You reckon? Alright, here we go. What could the last one be? We don't want a spawner. I already got that. I already got that. I don't have that yet. Ooh. It's a very interesting pick. Come on, let's get a shirt. Eyes on the shirt. Yes! We got the chest plate. I'm looking rather fancy, I must say. <laughs> Thanks for the audience, everyone. <laughs> Let us know what you think in the comments. Thank you. I can't even pronounce that. Avi nomin nominus? <laughs> or should I just call you Jojo? Oh. I also forgot I have mega keys. Let's go open them. Mega keys. Let's see what we can get. Oh, 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 oh. Ruby axe. Uh, do I risk the reroll? You know what? Why not? I got six of them. Let's re-roll it. Oh, 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 oh. Cow spawner? Not bad. Alright, cool. I have an idea I could use for this. Ooh, do I want a second cow spawner? No, we're gonna re-roll it. Let's see if we can get a tool or something. Oh, no, 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 no. That's so sad. I should have kept the cow spawner. Okay, what's the next thing going to be? A blaze spawner. Nah. I can get blaze spawners with the spawn wrenches, so I should be fine. I want an item. Oh, you're so close. Alright, I guess I'm getting a second cow spawner. Okay, here we go. Come on. Show me the money. Nah, not a fan of the rainbow outfits. Come on, Elytra! Yes! We gotta back up Elytra now. XP? I don't need it. Come on, items. Let's get something cool. Oh, oh. Aww. Last key. Let's see what we get. Ooh, do I, should I roll it again? Do I want to risk it? You know, I'm going to risk it. Come on, something big. Big, 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 big. Oh, rename Relic. Okay. That's kind of useful. <laughs> so this whole episode started with me getting a new outfit, getting the wrong outfit, getting another outfit, and by the end of it, I nearly look like the Easter Bunny. <laughs> That's so cool. And I got my little chicken nugget behind me. Oh, it's amazing. But that's all I've got time for today. Thank you all for watching, if you have watched. Thank you so much. And from me and little chicken nugget here, I'll see you next time. Bye.